I would, um, you know, I would hope that he's going to be able to do something great. I want to see this game continue on and keep on going. Now, uh, we do see that there is another expansion here being laid down in the half base here uh, from Dragon as he lays that down. He will be trying to get his economy out and effectively doing so. Um, the force is right now from Lax moving forward. Dude, Fire Silver, these Colossus may get caught with their pants down. We have to see if uh, Relax can keep his head on his shoulders here. He might want to move those Zealots to the front. We'll have to find out how this goes down. Yeah, doesn't have blink either, so cannot blink behind them. Uh, doesn't want to keep them in the back and end up having half his army useless for most of that fight. Uh -oh. This could be a good engagement though for Hase, uh, or Dragon, as he's going to move in. Guardian Shields go up twice now, so wasting two of those. Going to try and run them out, but it doesn't look like he's going to be able to right now. Uh, the Colossus do not have Thermal Lance yet, and it's still not being researched at the moment. I don't think... Oh no, it has been. I bet I was looking at Void Ring. Um, <laughs> but he is going to stim away right now, and it's kind of odd he's forcing a stim to run away right now. Um, as we do see, Malax just trying to play safe at the moment. Not the best concave there for Dragon, and that stim was wasted, uh, and that really could be punished here by Relaxed. And look at this, man. Relax punishing these Marauders here. That's Sim making them run all the way back. As we do see scans being laid down, a little bit of a stressful situation here for these Marauders and Marines. Now, there are quite a bit of medvacs here on very high health, or very high energy, as it were. And it looks like these Marauders are going to go ahead and push around the side here, Fire Silver. And they're going to start working down on these Zealots. The forces here from uh, Relax are going to go ahead and move back. Now, we don't see any Blink still. I would love to see some Charge Lots and some Blink possibly going down. Relax now moving forward. He does. He did have a forward pylon, but it looked like it did get taken out. There are Vikings now out in the air. Look at this force inside of Relax, or inside of Dragon's base. He's got those Marines and Marauders. We do have these uh, Stalkers now going forward. The main engagement's going down. Everything has been loaded up into those Medvac dropships, and it looks like it's going to be a d -d 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 doom drop in the back of Relax's base as Relax is now starting to take down the forces and the base of Dragon. Dragon doom dropping right now in that lower third area, and it looks like. He's dropping out one of those medbacks. Another one will be dropping down. And more and more of those forces will be accumulating right up there. As we do see a forward pylon going down. And it looks like it's a little bit of a base race situation. As we see Relax now moving into the third base. And it looks like uh, these are mar Marauders and Marines now going to be tearing up those uh, pylons. And working into the natural expansion. I can't believe it, man. The Dragon trying to go for a little bit of a counterattack while that attack was coming in. He knew something was going to happen very soon with this Protoss death ball. And Relax now trying charging the ramp with the superior force to what Dragon's got in here. How is this going to work out here for Relax? Will he be able to take down the base and the forces here of Dragon and work down the forces here inside of the inside of his main base right now, taking out production facilities? Now, I believe he does have a probe up here right in the front with his forces as he starts to work this down. He's going to be taking out that supply depot, now working down these barracks and taking down the production facilities here of Dragon. Dragon now losing quite a bit, moving and microing his Marines and Marauders around. These these Vikings now trying to take out a Colossus. They're going to take out the first Colossus. Blink goes down right on top of the Colossus. And it looks like these Vikings are going to get taken out as the next main target here. He does not want to lose that last Colossus. And that is uh, that last Colossus is going to stand. The rest of these Marauders are going to get taken out here, man. And it looks like Dragon has lost all of his forces inside of his main base. But yet again, he has also taken out all the forces inside of Relax's main base. And now working down Relax's buildings, we do see these probes now on their way out in a little bit of a cute uh, fashion one by one now getting the hell out of there as we do see uh, dragon continuing to build and uh, starting to lay down four barracks up here on the high ground this game has gone into a base race situation and it looks like relax wants to go back to his main base and protect himself yeah, this is, this is a crazy game. Uh, I'm going to have to use those probes. doesn't want to get caught out of position, though. The problem is it's upgrades versus tech right now. Uh, having one and two on those Marauders and having only plus one on the Protoss forces. He's doing a good job. They've got to keep that Colossus alive. And the extra Void Ray uh, could potentially uh, you know, do enough damage just to keep it alive and able to take down those buildings later on. But all the forces were demolished right now. But, you know, even so, I mean... We have 16 supply for Dragon versus only 34 for Relax. So he didn't get that far ahead, but both players are floating so much money. But Dragon has this mining base that has been mining for quite a while. Uh, most of the mineral patches are already uh, starting to recede right now and bunkering up already. So uh, looks like he's planning for some sort of defense, but like so many Raxes, uh, he can spend money on instantly. And look at this, man, even a starport landing up in the 12 o'clock position, trying to stay safe. Another expansion going down now from a dragon.
Dragon currently sitting on about 400 or about uh, about 300 minerals now. Uh, the forces here from Relax are going to work down the rest of the supply depots and the loose building structures here from Dragon. Knowing that there is another base due to the fact that he cannot see any of the uh, buildings, he will blink down a stalker in this lower third trap and SCV. Oh my god, he is just he just demolished and just killed uh, just destroy that SCV there. I don't know what else to say. But anyways, Dragon now moving that uh, that command center up into his uh, into his new main base, as it were. Lots of uh, lots of racks, man. Lots of marauders and marines on their way. Vikings even being produced out of the loose starboard up here, or proxy starboard, if you will. Oh, oh yeah. man. This Colossus sitting right there in the open. Not a very good place for it to be. As we do see that Colossus now taking down a marine. Will we see Relax actually take down Dragon here? Fire Silver, it looked a very promising right now for our buddy Relax. Indeed, man. Um, Marauder's trying to get out of there. But the thing is, is that Dragon, although he was in such a bad position, did a really, really good job of coming back from this. Um, and as long as he managed to break these bunkers, he's in a good spot. I like that bank, uh, bunker transfer at the last minute there. But the thing is, it's just that there's not much anti-air at the moment. But still, this game is extremely close from what it was. And now that one Void Ray able to pick off that Marine and also start working on some of these buildings and SCVs. But I'd like to say it could go either way at the moment, yeah, but me too. it really depends. You know, it, I mean, this Viking dude, he just took out the Void Ray. Only thing left are the Stalkers. He defended it. Fire Silver. Fire Silver. What are we watching? This is insanity. He is defended against that push. He has taken out the forces of Relax. Relax now forced to lay down more and more. Oh, mother. Dark Shrine on the way down right now from Relax. He's got his third base up. He's got a cannon. He's got his uh, natural expansion up. He's got a cannon. He's got the defense. We've got a, a SCV scouting around. That's one thing that Dragon has always done this game. Being on the Slayers team, always wanting to scout and to see what's going on. Um, dude, this is not over. This is not, maybe not even close to over. These players are duking it out. Bloody, bloodied faces, bloodied knuckles, and battered bases, man. I mean, it is looking very, very awesome. Now, right now, Dragon looks promising. He's got, uh, he's got more of an army force out. He's uh, got more supply out. He's got 24 supply, or he's got 28 supply committed to 24 out from Relax. Relax just now got his warp gates up. He will take down that SC. Oh, SCV gets down to three health, stays alive. Dragon will not go down this easily. <laughs> um, but yeah, I mean, it feels like we're back at the start of the game, but Relax has uh, 25 probes and only nine SCVs for um, Dragon at the moment. So as OP as you think Mules might be, I don't think he's going to be able to save him unless he can do some damage. He does have a Reaper going over though. Um, he does have the upgrades, which is going to help him out in the next few engagements, but um, I, I sense Dark Templar. Where are they? There they are. Two Dark Templar coming in across the map. Um, he is probably going to be using that uh, energy to use a mule, so that really could kill him in this game. He hasn't used it yet, though. Is he going to use it? This is going to be very, very close. Dude, it's going to be very, very close indeed, and look at this. He used it. Oh, no. He's not going to be able to scout this out or scan it. And look at that. He picks up instantly that Marine. And now picking up the forces to try to protect that. Oh, my God. That Marauder at the last second gets picked up. This Dark Templar now doing some wondrous damage. Two Dark Templars working on this Orbital Command. That Orbital Command now getting beat up here. Dragon looks like he's in a little bit of a pickle as he is going to go ahead and scan and only take down one of those Dark... Or no. Yeah, I believe he took... GG! Yeah, dude, GG! It goes down! Relax is beaten down, Dragon! Dragon is out of the go for SE2 Cup! It is over, people! Relax has taken down Dragon! What's up? I was watching Dragon on his stream. He's face palming right now. Oh, man. That was... A, what a game that was, man. What a game indeed. We're gonna go ahead and run a quick commercial break. That was crazy. Whoa. I just gotta make sure everybody is out of the game before I start doing this uh, commercial. What a fantastic game. Let's go and play some music right now. 
some Skrillex. Oh my god, dude. Relax, just beat down Dragon. Slayer's Dragon. Relax, looking like uh, phenomenal. Just a great play. Um, right. Every day casting, I lose. That's insanity. Insanity. Right. And uh, I, I just... I don't know what to think, man. I'm totally, I'm totally in shock and awe. That was such a wonderful game. What a good, uh, what, what, you know, what fantastic play. Uh, I can't believe Dragon got uh, knocked out already of the go for SC2 by Relax. Um, but Relax, you know, doing a good job. Uh, you know, it looked like he uh, played that game wholeheartedly and straight to the uh, straight to the cons. So he will go ahead and continue in this uh, in this event. Let's go ahead and get another game locked and loaded. Um, I need to go uh, right now and uh, take a little bit of a bio break. But uh, you guys got anything cool to talk about? We'll find something. We'll find something, man. I mean, Trey can probably talk about Minecraft and, and the server and stuff. Right, Trey? Dude, I was so shocked when I saw that GG. I was like, no way. No way this is over. Insanity. Insanity. Corn will be pleased. It seems like Drango was pretty shocked as well. Yeah, I mean, everybody should have been, and there was a lot of uh, a lot of people out there trolling, a lot of people out there uh, hating and whatnot. But you know, it's it's okay. I mean, but uh, regardless of all that, man, I just got to say that last game was just too much. It was amazing. Made me happy to see. Very, very awesome, awesome game. Reminded me a lot of uh, a lot of the old days, which made me happy to see. Oh my god, I think, I think Relax didn't actually know that he was playing against, he didn't know. <laughs> Relax never knew that he was actually playing against Slayer's Dragon. Uh, Dragon's review. Wow, th that's pretty funny. Neat, I am very amused. Oh, I was thinking about like, tuning in because I wanted to see uh, if he won and just see the look on his face. He'd probably be dancing around the room again, I don't know. No. His face is going pretty hard. Poor dragon. It's pretty funny though because Relax, like, he didn't even know he was facing him. <laughs> I think that's a good thing. I think he might not have won because of uh, Yeah, pressure. he might have been intimidated. Wow, I, I lived the day to see a foreigner beat a Korean in a tournament.